doesn't make us because all the aluminum like I, cu I couldn't get friends to come in the house like i mean i could like some of them understood but you know it, it's hard with that and it's hard if you if you call police or anything you look crazy and um so it sets you up for even more pain sometimes um I mean, I'm not telling anybody what to do because I, I mean, I was living in that enclosure and it did, I mean, it worked. It worked, uh, you know, it worked practically. It stopped a lot of the directed energy, a lot of the heat stuff, a lot of the V2K I'd get in there and I'd hear no V2K. Um, so it was good, but I think that it's time, it's time for a new prototype and I need to live a regular life too. Like, I feel like that was the clunky, uh, you know, in Iron Man, the clunky metal outfit that he made when he was trapped in the cave and I feel like I need to just break out I need to break out and find some kind of new prototype uh and and what I mean by that is like something that looks nice and that you know I can invite somebody into my room or my house which that corrugated steel ain't going to do the job unless I figure out something um kind of creative with it but I wanted to tell y'all um it I mean it does work and stuff but in this room like in the bathroom in this room, and my bathroom's filthy, I'm sorry, but in the bathroom in this room, uh, I hear the, uh, I hear the V2K, like really, uh, like a lot more than I do when I'm in the kitchen. Because when I'm in the kitchen, it has to pass through, like a lot of this wall, it has to pass through this wall with aluminum, that, the bathroom wall with aluminum. So it has to pass through all this and these things with aluminum. It has to pass through this wall, like, to hit me here. So, it's diminished the further away I get from the guy, you know, because he is in that house. Um, but what I'm going to do, you know, I'm going to try and figure it out. And, like, and like my roommate's cool. Like, she doesn't, she's like, you can, you know, sleep wherever you want. Or, you know, it's like, it, it's very easy going. I'm not, I'm not uh, married to this room right here. Um, but what I want to do, and that... Fan. I might have to take out that fan to do it. I don't know. I guess I can just put it right. Yeah, I can do that. I can. I can. What I want to do is I'm getting some copper mesh. I'm getting copper mesh that's like really uh, fine copper mesh, and it's going to be 36 inches by 50 feet. So it's going to be three feet by uh, by 50 feet. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to start maybe about that. You know, you see, uh, you see where the corrugated steel ends. Maybe a little bit above that, and I'm gonna go around. I'm gonna try and I'm gonna go around uh, the room, the ceiling, and just do a little. Uh, you know, it's, uh, what, what's it called? I can't think of it. Um, oh my God, I can't think of that. A spiral. I'm just gonna do. I'm gonna do it in a spiral. You know, uh, and I'm gonna start like down low so that anything remote that they're shooting in uh they'd have to get a really uh sharp angle there um and i think that'll that'll help a lot i'm going to test it out because copper is supposed to be the best thing uh still got a little bit of aluminum you know it's still still kind of cleaning up i might i don't know in the back i might leave some um you know this room this other room is uh let's see this other room is just filled with stuff we're just packed we're just like you know loading it up with stuff kind of a, a storage room right now but we're gonna fix it up we're gonna fix everything up and get rid of a lot of stuff and and here's you know this stuff here uh, i'm keeping it here for now um but slowly but surely i'm kind of i'm gonna do something else you know i'm gonna figure something else out the aluminum just looks so it looks so crazy and I don't know, it, it, it kind of feels like it controls me. You know, it makes me like feel like I can't invite the people to my house. So I want to do something that's like a new prototype that people would, would uh, just look at and be like, hey, that's, that's kind of artsy or something like that. Um, and I, I did want to mention, well, I'll do another video about that. Not right now, I don't want to do a video about that. But, um what else what else is going on that's about it for me in my story right now um the attacks like aren't that bad uh but the v2k is bad so and and that's why like a lot of people are like you know you're um you know you're letting them get to you or whatever 
And the deal is with that um, is that the V2K, like them talking all the time or, or uh, their recorded voices, you know, being beamed like, uh, you know, RF modulated and then beamed by a microwave into your skull. Um, it really, it, it makes your focus on them it, like you can't even help it because you're hearing what they're saying and they're saying nasty stuff or they're saying bad stuff. Mine are like, I mean, they're just like insane. Like they're like, you know, oh, it, it, it's over. You know, we're going to, like they'll say, we're going to kill him tonight or whatever. It's like, it's crazy. It went from like, I like fucking with this guy. That's what the guy said to, um to, um, you know, let's, we're gonna kill them tonight, and, uh, they, I mean, they're not hurting me enough to do that, but I don't know, I don't know if he's holding back, and then when I go to sleep, you know, he'll just pour it on, um, I really don't, I really don't know, but the, the, I'm gonna keep all the plugs in their outlets, and, and, you know, we're gonna use, like, uh, extension cords or, um, uh, surge protectors, to plug everything in but it's nice i mean look at this this is what it was supposed to look like i've showed you all the aluminum stuff and i mean this is what it was supposed to look like this is what i did at the beginning um before you know before i knew i was being attacked i had it all uh painted white you know it's not not finished yet and it is we, we might need to do another coat because the, the you can kind of see a, a glimmer of that that aluminum but this is what it was supposed to look like, you know? This is what, when I came to this house, this is what I was working on. And then it was just like the high-pitched sound, and I knew that, you know, that this guy was involved, and then, you know, watching videos and sleeping in the kitchen. Um, so it, it kind of it kind of spiraled down. And uh, that's what, I mean, I've been fighting the fight. I, you know, I, I think I did the right thing. You know, I protected my body. Um, I know people don't understand that. They think that, you know, I'm letting people control me or something. But what I was worried about was survival. Um, you know, I was just worried about, like, you know, just protecting my body as much as I could um, so that I could go out, out in the world and, like, you know, work a job or whatever. Right now, I'm like, um, you know, I have a, a Social Security uh, appeal date. So I'm going to talk to the judge and... You know, hopefully I can get some Social Security, um, you know, and kind of go from there. Um, I hope everybody's doing all right. I just wanted to kind of show you. Show you my house. We're cleaning it up, uh, getting all the aluminum and corrugated steel. You know, I'll just, I'll put it in the back. I'll put it in my room and, uh, and see what I can do. But I'm not sure. I'm kind of, I'm experimenting back here with uh how bad it's in here and i may i may make my room the other room um i haven't even slept on this mattress so i've just kind of been in the kitchen um i don't know it's it's i guess i i mean I, it's it's really such um like i think they were getting through my my uh enclosure because i think they were hitting me remotely and they were just coming in at a certain angle so at times i think it was just kind of you know like i had no enclosure um, but it's, at times I would get into a certain position and, you know, it would really work. So, um, you know, the, these things work, aluminum works, corrugated steel works. Um, you know, I'm going to try out the copper now. The copper was expensive and like, I owe my mom a lot of money now. Um, but I'm going to try the copper mesh and, um, you know, let y'all know. I'm going to put it all over, like, I'm going to put it above, like, everywhere, above where I sleep in that room. Um, and it might look cool, and then we could do it in other rooms, maybe. You know, if it looks cool, and uh, my roommate, you know, is like, oh, man, well, that's neat. We could maybe do that in every other room. And then I'd have a, like, just, it'd be awesome. You know, if it works, you know, I could go into any room and just be, be really comfortable. We could tell people it's just, like, we just thought about doing it as some kind of, you know, experiment or, you know, some kind of art thing, I don't know, I don't know, or, or maybe telling the truth, you know, um, it just seems like normal people, though, they, they reel against this, they, like, it's just like, you know, you gotta get out of this, you know, a lot of people are like, you know, you gotta snap out of this, and they think that we can just, think, just be like, okay, it's not happening, because they think we're crazy, or they think, um, you know, they, 
they think whatever. They think that some of it's happening, but, you know, we're going too far or something like that. I've heard that a lot. You know, that we, well, some of this could be happening, but you're going way too far and you're paranoid. Um, which, you know, I, I don't mind. Like, when people talk to me about it and they don't believe it or something, um, you know, I understand. Uh, try and just tell them, like, it's like, well, you say what you say, and then um, I'm going to have to deal with it anyway. You know, I'm going to have, it's, it's going on, you know. Um, but that's, that's pretty much all I wanted to say. I did want, I want to give a shout out to Brian and, uh, everybody try that. Uh, you know, if, if, if you're not, I don't know if you're not Christian, um, you know, maybe, maybe whatever holy book, um, that you read, you know, do that for 30 minutes a day and, uh, we'll try it and see, like I've tried it a day, you know, it did, I think it did kind of help. I think, you know. Um, he says that you do it 30 minutes a day for a long time, the, the V2K is reduced. Um, Brian, comment, uh, if, if I'm wrong about that, that the V2K told you to do it, because that's kind of a little bit fishy, but I'm not sure if he said that. Uh, I'm sorry, I've been getting, like, I've been getting hit heavy, so, you know, I'm, I'm a little bit, like, foggy on my memory. Um, I really do hope y'all are doing well. Um, you know, I'm just... I'm taking pictures of, like, my messy house right now. Um, but, yeah, and this is kind of a mess in here. But we're getting it fixed up. I mean, it's a it's a fixer-upper right now, and it's kind of normal. I, I like the normalness of it. I like it because this is what I was doing before I, got, I started getting heavily targeted in this house, and it feels good. It feels like I'm uh, getting back or something. Like, it's like... Because this is what I want it to do. I wanted it to be, you know, white. And I want it to, you know, stay in my room. And whatever comes, I mean, at least I'm, I'm kind of uh, kind of doing something different. And and that's important to me. I, I, I guess that's, that's probably important to all target individuals. It's like, um, you know, I felt like every day it was just like I was in the enclosure. They're attacking me. Um, you know, I go out a little bit, like, to, to work or you know, um, maybe, a, I don't know, just like, you know, go to the store or something like that, and it's just like, it's like a trap, it's like a trap, and I was just kind of sitting there, and, um, you know, it was just same old, same old every day, and I mean, they're hitting me now, they're, they're still, it's, it's happening, it's not like I took my enclosure down, and I'm, you know, uh, you know, everything's good, because people are actually pointing directed energy weapons at me and shooting them. Um, so it's not like I'm just like, oh, okay, I'm over it now, uh, because the enclosure's gone. Um, and that's the thing, it's, it's hard for people. It's hard for people who aren't targeted, they're, they're nice people. They're nice people who are just like, you know, they can't believe it, they reel against it. If, if they did believe it, you know, they would be, you know, it's just like, they, they, they say get over it, you know. And I know that's, that's tough for us, because we are actually being hurt very badly we're being microwaved and experimented on and then and then uh you know in society we're being uh labeled as as dangerous people or lied about and it's tough it's real um and and it's like a lot of people are like you know why would they pick you or something like that that's one of the big arguments but uh the deal is it's like it doesn't matter who you are because they're just they're testing the equipment out you know they're testing the equipment out they're making money they don't really care who you are, you know, they don't care, they, they're trying to just make an enemy, you know, make somebody that's like, oh, that person, you know, that person's bad, or that person did something, like, even if you're innocent, so, um, so, you know, I mean, that's the deal with it, and it's, you know, it's really tough, it's tough, uh, you know, for my family, it's tough for people around me, and, like, this guy is, go is crazed, he's, like, hitting, you know, uh, my, my friend who I hang out with a lot, he's like targeted and he's very spiritual. So he's got like three of us getting hit. We're all, I mean, we can collaborate our stories like that. We can learn a lot from this and he's crazy. Like this guy, he's going buck wild on it. So, um, either that's really bad for me. Um, I mean, I don't know. I, I, I hear a lot of people, they have really bad targeting too. So I probably don't have the worst of it. This guy is insane. I mean, he's going for like 
Uh, that's my friend now, so I'm going to get off, but I will uh, talk to you guys later. All right. Love you guys, and God bless. Be strong out there. Don't give up.